Hi there, so on September the 7th, 2014, I, yes me, the most unfit, lazy man in the world, I'm going to do the Great North Run, probably one of the most famous half marathons. Now a half marathon is 13.1 miles long, and I've been wondering just how long is 13.1 miles? I've, I've never really gauged how long that is as a distance. So, yesterday I decided to go out there and go through the entire course of the Great North Run. So, over to me at the start line. So. A lot of people think it starts on the Tyne Bridge, this Great North Run, but it doesn't. It actually starts just down there. Uh, and I'm on a motorway and people are looking at me very funny. Yes, hello. Um, so instead of, you know, walking it, giving you a nice little tour of the bit, oh, uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm uh, instead going to be dead lazy and drive the whole thing because, well, I'm not going to walk it, give you a nice scenic tour. I'm just going to drive it. The weather's rubbish. I can feel it's gonna rain sometime soon. So uh, yeah, that's that. Let's go. So as I said, yeah, it's on a motorway. Uh, that's, it's, it's not the most exotic of places to do a, a Great North Run. Oh, Astra. Uh, so it all starts right underneath that bridge, I think. I don't really know. Uh, yeah, and it's pretty much on a motorway for a bit. I'm gonna fast forward this a little bit because otherwise it's just, it's gonna take a whole lot of while. Anyway, so why am I doing this, you know, Great North Run then, well, I just don't know. Oh, the Time Bridge! With the Time Bridge already! Oh, that's nice, isn't it? That's pretty much the only picturesque thing about it, you know? It's quite nice, though. And then you kind of go off into gates and, uh, let's take a bit of a turn for the worse. Anyway, so, why am I doing the Great North Run? Because I decided I was getting a little bit portly in my old age and kind of thought, well, I need something to motivate me to come and you know get a bit more fit probably more importantly i'm doing it for the prince's trust which is the charity here in the uk that is designed to help young people they help people aged from 13 all the way up to 30 people who may be struggling with employment or people struggling at school who may end be suffering from mental health problems or people who are homeless and many many more the reason i decided to help the prince's trust was because at that young age from 13 all the way pretty much up to 30 is such a pivotal part of life if things go seriously wrong for you as a young person i think it's going to be so much more difficult to lead that happy stable life that you know everyone wants later on that's why it's crucial that charities like the prince's trust are able to provide the help and support to get young people back on track so that's why in a few months time i'm going to be publicly embarrassed myself Great! Kind of hoping they have those like travelator things along the side for the really lazy people so you only have to do like half the distance. Now in the description there's a link to my given page where you can see all the updates about my training. <laughs> training. And also give you the chance to donate. Now I know that for everyone money's tight but to quote a supermarket without hopefully getting sued every little helps. And that pound will be going to helping young people possibly in your area. Am I lost in... Okay so I think that's it. I think that's the route. Um... But I've only ever been to South Shields once before in my life, and I was very young. Um, so I'm a little bit lost. Uh, so whilst I try and find my way back home, it's back to me in the studio. Nothing more to add, really. But if you do want to donate, then please check out the link below. Thanks.